welcome to The Dining Show. I'm your host, Kristen Wood. We're hanging out at the Boathouse Restaurant on the pier where they have some delicious fresh fish items on the menu, as well as some yummy cocktails to enjoy right here on the lake. Then we're gonna head over to Heidi's where they do breakfast best. It's all coming up right here on The Dining Show. Welcome back to The Dining Show. We are here at the Boathouse Restaurant on the pier. We are right on the lake, and it's not every day you get a tour of the menu with the executive chef, executive chef himself, Michael Quintal. Hi, Mike, how's it going? Good, how are you? Doing great. I'm very excited uh, to try everything on the menu, but first, we're gonna start off with some appetizers. Mm -hmm. Now, you are all about your seafood here. Mm -hmm. Tell me about these crab cakes. Uh, we use a blend of three different kinds of crab meat, and. Uh, the secret is not to use too much filler, let the crab speak for itself. Uh, we make our own sauces here. We have a, mm -hmm. a real nice roasted red pepper remla that goes with that and that just complements the, the crab meat really well. And that's a secret recipe you won't, you won't give me. I don't tell anybody <laughs> that. I don't tell anybody that. Yeah. All right, and then moving on to one of the most popular dishes here at Boathouse mm -hmm. is the ahi. Uh, we have a seared uh, sesame crusted seared ahi. Uh, we have a balsamic a reduction that we use with it, and uh, wasabi and uh, pickled ginger. Sounds and it's great. real popular, nice fresh item. Yeah. But nice little bites if you just want a snack. Mm -hmm. And then moving on to the entrees here, tell me a little bit about um, this ahi dish I have in front of me. Uh, we have a little bit larger version with this. We have stir fried vegetables. Uh, we serve it with a, a nice wasabi cream, uh, pickled ginger. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a nice portion, and uh, all of this is fresh. Comes in fresh. Yeah, tell me about that. Your fresh or your fish comes in very fresh. You uh, said, we uh, get uh, deliveries three, four, five times a week. Uh, mostly from everything comes from the Pacific, uh, mm -hmm. out of Hawaii or Alaska. That's where we get all the fresh. So three, four times. So it's literally straight from, pretty much straight from the ocean to yeah, your plate. That's it. As <laughs> fresh as we can get it. Great. And then you also have some great steaks on the menu. Uh, this um, is this is an old staple. It's a, a bacon wrapped filet, mm -hmm. and we use our boathouse butter, which is a just a compound herb butter over the top of it, and it's very very popular. Nice tender tender piece of meat. And it comes with these rosemary tomatoes. Yes, yes. Uh, and fresh red potatoes and uh, fresh vegetables. And fresh vegetables sounds mm -hmm. great. Well, I got my fruity cocktail here. Mm -hmm. um, let's talk about a little bit about you, Chef Mike. Where Where are you from? When did How, how long have you been in Tahoe? Uh, I came up here almost 40 years ago for a weekend. Uh, my oldest brother asked me if I wanted a job in the kitchen, and uh, I should have said no, but uh, <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> and I've been in Lake Tahoe ever since. Almost. You guys are literally on the lake, right mm -hmm. here yeah, on the, the pier. Lake's right beneath it, right beneath us. Yep. And uh, you also have indoor and outdoor seating. Yeah, we serve outside. We serve on the pier. And uh, a lot of people enjoy the pure dining. Yeah. And um, I noticed that you can get some really great quality food items and a very reasonably priced. Um, now, I was very interested in, in this glass of um, bottle of wine. Um, Chateau Montalene, it's one of our most popular wines. We, uh, our wine list is heavy on Napa Sonoma. We okay. do have some local vineyards around uh, Placerville area that we, we use also. Um, and uh, we have a pretty fair selection, I believe. Nice. Speaking of local, you also. Um, get all your breads from? Yeah, we get, uh, we serve a fresh bread daily here that we get from the Sugar Pine uh, Bakery right across the street. Uh, bake it for us daily and it's a, a really good bread. And uh, I just love that, local businesses supporting mm. other local businesses. Yep. Yep. Just keeping it right here in Tahoe. Um, real quick, tell everybody exactly where you're located. Uh, we're right across the street from the Safeway in the middle of town, uh, right on the lake behind the, uh, the hotel, the Beach Retreat and Lodge, we're behind that on the lake and right on top of the pier, you can't miss it. All right, sounds great. Well, we're gonna dig in, and then up next, we're gonna go try some uh, sunset sippers, some more of these fruity cocktails there here. There we go. We'll be right back. Welcome back to The Dining Show. We're still here at the Boathouse Restaurant on the Pier, and I'm with Lisa here. She is the Director of Catering. And Lisa, uh, a lot of people might not realize that you guys do catering here. We do. The, uh, the Boathouse and our executive chef runs uh, with myself the catering department, so we facilitate events and weddings here in the Boathouse on the Pier, as well as the 
hotel behind us, the Beach Retreat uh, and Lodge at Tahoe. Great, and it's a great location, especially at this time of year. You know, summertime's right around the corner. And you have, I love this uh, drink special that you guys have. It's called Sunset Sippers. Tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, Sunset is extremely important to the boathouse on the pier. And uh, we take it very serious here. So we actually, uh, every day our bartenders will uh, put up on our clock up here a uh, sunset time. Mm -hmm. And for a half an hour before and a half an hour after sunset, we have uh, four fabulous sunset sippers that right. people can order. They're at a great um, offer at $5 a piece, and they're to kind of resemble the different colors of the sunset that we see here from right. the boathouse. Right. Now, I know one thing, now the warmer's, uh, the weather's warmer, one thing that I really love when I get off work is I just want to find somewhere I can sit outside, enjoy the view, enjoy the warm weather, and have a cocktail. And so you guys have the outdoor seating and the view. We do. We have seating out on our deck up here. We have, uh, our windows can open uh, depending how the weather is that day. We also mm -hmm. have seating on the pier for cocktails and dining. And I love the names of these cocktails. Real quick, we don't have to say everything that's in them, but um, tell me the names. I, which mm -hmm. one was I drinking earlier? Uh, you had the Skinny Dip, which Skinny is dip. Um, the one that's made with uh, tequila mm -hmm. base. And the other ones are made with rum. So we have the Backflip, the Skinny Dip, our Belly Flop, and the <laughs> Cannonball. That's so great. I love the names. And these were all um, invented by our, our staff here. Great. It's very specialty cocktail. Mm -hmm. And you're saying Sunset's very important to the pier. This place is a great option for boaters, very convenient for boaters. Yes, this is the first uh, year that the boathouse will also uh, be able to uh, provide boater boxes, as we call them. Mm -hmm. And uh, boaters can call into the boathouse and order uh, basically uh, a to-go order that we nice. will um, bring to them when they pull up uh, by boat. Or if they want to stay a little bit longer and enjoy some cocktails and dinner or lunch, they uh -huh. can um, have a place to um, moor their boat and uh, enjoy their, their meal here. Right, and then, so you don't just have the sunset sippers, you also have a regular happy hour every day. Every day from three to five, there's a happy hour menu with uh, mm -hmm. food specials and drink specials. And then I love, uh, you guys have such creative names here, Wine Not Wednesdays. Yes. Tell me about that. Wine Not Wednesdays uh, is uh, more focused on our wine. So we have wine specials mm -hmm. and then we have live entertainment from 6 to 9 p.m. with various local artists. Nice. That sounds so much fun. And then what's this Sunday? It's a, it's a tongue twister of a name. It is a tongue twister of <laughs> a name. It's called Sunday Songs with Bloodies and Bubbles. And again, we have live music mm -hmm. and that runs from two to five on Sundays. And then we have um, drink specials with Bloody Marys and mimosas. That sounds delicious. It's perfect Sunday menu mm -hmm. right there, Bloody Mar Marys and mimosas. Um, and then all summer long, you guys have special events going on as well. Like tell me about the wine walk. Yes. Uh, we are kicking off our summer of fun here at the Beach Retreat and Lodge and the Boathouse. And we will have, uh, this will start uh, June 21st until the end of September mm -hmm. and we'll have uh, various times that we'll do uh, we're gonna call them wine walks on the pier but we are uh, having local and um, special wineries that'll come to showcase mm -hmm. their wines at different times so people can again enjoy a little different taste all right that sounds great now one more time tell people about this amazing location mm -hmm. where the boathouse is located and how they can get more information about catering about your happy hour about your menu all that stuff yes. You can find um, information on our website at TahoeBeachRetreat.com under the mm -hmm. restaurant section as well as the caterings. Uh, you can call us at 530-600-1846. You can make reservations on OpenTable.com or find us on Facebook at Boathouse Tahoe. Sounds great. And we're right here on the lake. We're going to go actually enjoy some of these drinks outside in the sunshine. Uh, thanks so much, Lisa. Thank you. We'll be right back.